Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here, and welcome back to World of Warcraft Dragonflight and our Eridar Draenei Rogue leveling campaign. We are starting things out here in Shadowmoon Valley today. Without faith, Let's talk to Prophet Velen. Battle is lost. Uh, are you the one that has led my children home? Yes, I am. Follow Prophet Velen. Many depend on you. Prophet. This hero and many others from another world have come to- It is good to see you, my child. My people welcome your aid, champion. Come with me. Prophet, I must warn you. The Iron Horde intends to strike out against all who oppose them. We must prepare our defenses. We will deal with one problem at a time. First, we must settle your people. Their mounts are much faster than mine. <laughs> they must have that level 40 mount going on. Thank you guys for being here, by the way, and for clicking on the video for the support on this series. I really do appreciate it, and I hope you are all doing well. I like that Shadow Moon Valley is actually dark. Ah, uh, that's a really nice aesthetic. Let us speak. Our enemies must fall. We wouldn't have survived to now without your strength, Rambles. Many Draenei and Alliance alike owe you a great debt. Plant the Alliance Plant banner. Plant your banner and claim your destiny. Oh, I'll claim it. I can open up a portal to Stormwind only briefly. I do hope my trust in your people is not misplaced. I assure you, my prophet, the commander we've chosen represents the very best of the Alliance. All right, come on through. Steady, steady. This is it, boys. Let's break some ground and take this world for the Alliance. For the Alliance. It's, uh, it's Barris Alexton. This is the, the City Hall guy, the town architect that we got the pocket watch for, or the compass for, in Hillsbred. Or Westfall, rather. We remember you. It's funny that they dig up some of these characters, and some of them I remember, and some of them I don't. Hello, Commander. It's also funny that Cadgar can open up a portal across space and time to Stormwind. That's a little bit weird. We, we won't think about it too much. Uh, a fist weapon or a dagger? I think we're just going to go with a dagger. These weapons are just absolutely freaking atrocious, though. <laughs> uh, the fist weapon is going to deal more damage, but it's slower. I, I really don't know. I'll call in a few favors. We'll get it done. Uh, we need to look for lumber. We need to mark eight trees. Well, if you mark those trees, Shelly's lumberjacks And we need to we'll kill some lunar fall ravens. On it. giant killer ravens. I have a feeling it's going to be a long, cold night. Ready to work. Ready to work.
Ready to work. Why are there no female peons? Hmm? Why are they not ready to work? What do you need? We've got a lot of work to do. Oh. An excellent choice of lumber, if I do say so myself. Well, it... impressive work, Commander. I know I'll sleep a lot better without those giant killer birds flying around. It is time to take a stand. I'm getting reports of a giant in the forest. A few of the carib or peacekeepers have followed it to a cave. In all honesty, I don't think any of our troops are willing to engage the beast. Kill Quakefist. The Prophet's faith was not misplaced. We must unite. With the giant defeated, we shouldn't have any more trouble clearing out the area. Orders, Commander. I think it's time we start putting up some walls and establishing a firm perimeter around the base. Is this where the garrison goes? It is where the garrison goes. Oh, no. <laughs> For the Alliance. Okay, so Shadow Moon Valley... I'll call in a few favors. Oh, no. Okay, not the whole zone. I, okay, at least there will be parts of the, I, I was worried the whole zone was for the garrison. Just say the word. That would have sucked. We'll Through your selfless actions, you have earned the respect of my people. They have granted you this foothold, confident that you will lead the Alliance to victory. Commander. Alright, and just like that, we have a garrison. Uh, and we also have a garrison hearthstone, maybe, once we turn the quest in. Let's see what's going on over here with SI7. What's your report, we got Agent? Kernan over here, and we got Bodrick. Well met. Familiar with Kernan, don't know Bodrick. Urel and Murad have a tactical suggestion. They recommend a small expedition group be sent into the savage wastelands of Gorgond, far to the north. 
Uh, seek your well at the Wildwood Wash in Gorgon. So this is like a bread grove. Go with honor, okay, we're not gonna do that now. Talk to me. Watch your back. What's on your mind? Good. The Archmage has uncovered a potential Shadow Council presence in the valley. He asked me to let you know. Alright, of course we have the Heroes Board here. We could bail out on this whenever we wanted to, I guess. My men are standing ready. On it. Uh, ship shell salvage. Collect 15 crates of drudge boat salvage. For the alliance, I'll call in a few favors. And speak with Shelly. Maybe find assistant Brightstone and check the use. garrison cache. <laughs> Besides tooth piercing devices, how am I supposed to do this all myself? <sighs> Keep it together, Barros. Keep it together. And we have a new talent point over in the rogue tree. Um. From the front. We're getting strange reports of an orc attack on a nearby Draenei settlement called Eventide Landing. The locals could use our help. This seems like the perfect opportunity to test our garrison's capabilities. Maybe you mean my commander. capabilities? If these I pale guess. orcs are real, who knows what powers they possess? I feel like the music might be overtaking some of the audio. Bump that down just a little bit. Welcome. See you soon. What can I do for you? Light bless you. Just say the word, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do. I feel so relieved. Maybe I can actually do some stargazing tonight. That would be a nice change of pace. Alright, so what do we want to do first? We have a couple of things up here to the north. Uh, let, let's go do this stuff up here. And then we'll head down to the south.
I got one shot in there and that was apparently all that I needed. I like how it has our name in the outpost name, Rambles Outpost. Never noticed that before. Hello, Commander. We'll get it done. Ugh, some of these supplies are really waterlogged and sticky. These pale orcs sound dangerous. Hopefully. This is the last we see of them. All right, now we're looking for blueprints. Learn the blueprints and use the architect table. We've got a lot of work to do. All right. Oh, they're right over here. look fantastic. You should go check in with Murad. I'm going to hang out here and admire my handiwork. King's honor, friend. Be careful. Where do we stand? With the barracks complete, we can finally shelter all of these troops from this eternal night. If we are to win this war, we are going to need more than foot soldiers. We need champions. Kiana Moon Shadow's performance in Tanan and Eventide Landing was quite impressive. Perhaps you should speak with her about taking on a greater role in the battle against the Iron Horde. Kiana just headed out to Moonflower Valley. 
She is quite eager to explore this new land. much to be done. Remain vigilant. For what must be done, I need someone I can trust. You're one of the few. The woods and the the woods and the orc village Gulvar are protected from my scrying magic. We need to pierce that veil. I think I know a way. I would like it if you and the warden were to capture it. The all-seeing gaze. Okay. Always have. I'm going ahead to the demon's lair. We'll capture it together. The priestess of the moon also has something to ask of you. Uh, the Archmage has asked me to prepare this moon well. Once it is complete, I'll be able to sanctify its water for use against the demon. Only one thing remains. A piece of one of Draenor's moons has fallen into a piece of one of Draenor's moons. Has fallen into a nearby pool on the far side of the wood. Such a thing is perfect for use in the dedication of the moon well to a loon. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, well, those have us going back to the north. Let's head down here. We'll talk to Kiana to see if we can recruit her for the garrison. She looks like she's in a little spot of bother. And it looks like they are going back to the garrison. We'll go back and we'll turn this one in. See if it changes into anything else. No time for dallying. There is more work to do on Draenor than we could possibly handle by ourselves. We need to start delegating. A group of night elves need a champion at Starfall Outpost. Kiana is a perfect fit for this mission. Remember that the beast in the shadows might be your salvation. Oh. Oh, the command table. What are we getting out of this? Base experience... Like, are we getting anything, like, super useful out of actually keeping up on these? Probably not. We'll do a couple of them and see. Command tables are kind of a cool concept, but... I don't know if they ever managed to make them interesting. You have my undivided attention. We must face our fears. All right, back over on the Outlaw Tree, we can get Repost. Dodging an attack will trigger Mastery, Main Gauche. This effect may only occur once 
every one second. Uh, sting like a bee, enemies disabled by your cheap shot. We're not using those. Restless blades, I don't even know what that is. Also, now also reduces the remaining cooldown of evasion and faint. Uh, retractable hook cooldown. Or precision shot. Let's just increase movement speed. Can't really go wrong with that. Come, speak with me. More recruits have arrived at your garrison every hour. We will soon run out of food. Okay. Whoa. Come on, people! Step it up here! We got hungry bellies to fill! You heard the commander! Move out! Go! Go! The prophet. Looks like Urel got some actual ah, armor on. one is the taskmaster. You will find our alliance is full of surprises, Exak. This is the commander I told you about. Commander, you have built the most impressive garrison. I'm eager to see your men in action. This we will escort this caravan and meet you in Elador, Commander. Faith is my mirror. But Prophet Velen has asked me to show you way. around Shadowmoon Valley. We will first go to Embari Village, where my sister Samara is waiting for us. I have not seen her since the Iron Horde took me to Tanan. Ah, yeah, your sister is probably going to die. Uh, we don't need to go there yet. I feel like I still have stuff to do. I'm going to take care of the stuff up here to the north first, before we head down here to do any of that. Elador. Where is he offering to take us? Storm Shield and Ashran. No idea where that is. That is a giant piece of moon. I, I didn't expect it to be quite so large, to be honest. Um, I mean, did she capture it or was that somebody else capturing it? I have no idea. Um, I have to feel like that was somebody else capturing it and that um, we now have to wait for a respawn or, or something. I'm, I'm really not 100. I saw somebody leading it out, but... What are the odds there would be another player here actually doing this quest? Oh no. <laughs> so that that's going to become an ability that I probably never use. I thought Grappling Hook would just target an enemy. 
But it doesn't work like that. Grappling Hook has a template that you have to lay down on the ground. I, I don't like abilities where I have to lay a template. So we, we might not be using a lot of Grappling Hook. Unless we want to like actually scale elevation, you know what I mean? Well done. I'll take it back to the outpost and see that it's secure. Come, foul creature. Mm, we have a little bonus event down here. I wonder... It's worth 47,000 experience. Seems like that could be worth quite a lot. We'll do that when we head out this way. Since it looks like we'll be doing quite a bit of running anyway. Embody village. It'd be easier to guard you if you stayed out of sight, Khadgar. I am not a child to cower beneath your cape, Cordana. We will defend Azeroth together. Long ago, the shamans of Shadow Moon clan erected three stones in the woods. There they performed their sacred rituals, blessing the beast and the trees. Now someone has placed a fell magic upon those stones. This corruption is what shrouds the villages of Glulvar. Before we can use the captured demon to safely peer into the Shadow Council's village, we must bring down those stones. Be mindful of your duty. Be wary. I suspect the stones will be heavily guarded. Dionys Akka. Peace be with you. Goddess watch over you. And may the stars guide you. Cordana tells me that the creatures of the woods are cursed by the same fell energies keeping Cadgar from scrying into the orc village. That will not do. If we were on Azeroth, I could find a cure in a reasonable time frame. However, we are not, nor do we have the luxury of time. Better to put a swift end to their suffering rather than allow these poor creatures to linger. Go in peace. Killing some wildlife.
another player? No. Impossible. Let's head over here and we'll check out this bonus objective. Nothing else is really going to take us out this way. I mean, if I can even find a way to get to it, I... I <laughs> it's a cave, so I'm probably not going to be able to find the entrance. I'm, I'm really bad at finding caves. I'm really bad at finding things at elevation. So, hmm. We'll, we'll look around on the other side of this, maybe. But chances are you know, that we won't be finding the cave. Unless it's like right around the corner here. I mean, this could be it. There's also just a, a straight up quest over here to grab. I will go with you, hero. A warm welcome awaits us at Embari Village. I'm not sure what village he's talking about, but there's no village around here. Uh, let's see. A vicious queen swamplighter has made the northern forest of Shadow Moon its home. It's too bad about that. Still not anywhere like sure about the cave, but we'll proceed in, in here a little bit and see what we can uncover. I mean, this looks like a cave to me. Got another quest here. Welcome, friend. 
stranger, please help me. My companions and I ventured here to seek the bounty of a monstrous wasp queen. After we set up camp down the hill, we fell asleep, but we were attacked in the middle of the night by these horrid, pale things. Always glad to help. Looking for her friends who are probably dead. There are a lot of players out and about today. Uh, this guy is actually an elite. Didn't realize that when I engaged him. His name is Gorum, not Golem, not to be confused with Golem, his name is Gorum, it's entirely different. He probably doesn't even have a Precious. No, he, uh... He had a precious, <laughs> a precious bloodthorn loop. Oh, blizzard. Oh, my dears. Oh, good. We're, we're in combat again.
Beliadoros. Clear skies and safe journeys. Alright, that's another level back over here in the rogue tree. Uh, now I don't really know, was this guy in the cave? The northern forest. Yeah, I don't know. Not sure where they're at. Maybe they're up on the elevated part. Let's see if we can get there. It, it looks like they're back in the cave. <laughs> but I feel like we, we pretty thoroughly explored the cave and I didn't see them in there. Of course, it's not going to be so easy as to go up the hill here. That'd be too easy. And here we go. This looks good. Might as well use the garrison ability and summon in a little bit of help. Alright, I, I think before we move on for anything else, let's go back and turn all this stuff in. I wonder if we can just use our garrison hearthstone. I, I don't know where that went. Okay, okay, cool. It became a toy. Oh no, can I not? Okay, we can put it here. We can't put it in our bag. Makes sense, I guess. I will go with you, hero. A warm welcome awaits us at Embody Village. Oh, this was not <laughs> this was not where we were turning in anyway. It got, got us a little bit closer, but no, the turn-ins are still outside the garrison. Your garrison is impressive, hero. Even Dranai builders could not work so quickly. Ah, good to see you. Now that the priestess Moonfang has created the blessed water, it is time to deal with the demon. Take the water and the scripture of Alun. Through the power of each, you will compel the demon to show us what the orcs are up to. It is a world of wonder. A world Be careful. of wonder. The okay. demon will try to trick you. Right. Not really sure what we're supposed to be doing here.
I, I think we did it. There we go. Shogal waves. Until... Someone loses an eye. Let's get to work. Always happy to help. Good to know what Terran Gore and Cho'Gal are up to. It's more important that we stop Gul'dan. Some of his disciples can summon minor demons. To do this, these lesser warlocks must use a soul shard. The foul creature crystals creates a connection to the Twisting Nether, pulling a demon through against its will. Gul'dan's as much demon as he is orc. If we can gather some of the more potent shards, we can combine them into something that just might capture him. Remain vigilant. She doesn't want me going with you. But I can help by magically projecting myself. Oh. You're right you're not going out there. I am honored. Elune light your bell. All right, well, we have more stuff to do over this way, so I think what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to have a break right here for today. When we come back, we will try to work over this way. We need to capture some shards to try to capture Gul'dan. We need to kill 20 Gul'var orcs. And eventually, we'll be heading out to see more of Shadow Moon Valley, including the warm welcome I'm sure we'll get at Umbari Village, because nothing could possibly be wrong there. It's Even gonna be a I joyous to town full of Draenei who are happy to see us. I, I'm sure of it. <clears throat> That's how things go in the game, right? Anyway, thank you guys very much for joining me here today. I really do appreciate it. If you're digging the content, leaving a like, subbing to the channel if you're not already, and ringing the bell, all that stuff helps me out immensely. And I appreciate those that do. Until next time, take care of yourselves out there and take care of each other. And we will see you back in Shadowmoon Valley sometime very soon. Bye for now.